Nice and lovely guys. So basically right here I have a medium sized pot on the stove with some corn. One, two, three, four, five corn inside of the pot. All right. And I have some mixed vegetables like some broccoli, cauliflower and carrot which I'm going to add to it to cook it. And that's going to show you guys that sometimes it's good for your students to make yourself some lovely vegetable at home. All right. So stay tuned and watch this video how I'm going to make this lovely 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 vegetable or to cook it off boil it off and all these things and this is where chef ricardo come in and they have things where you can do at home so sweet corn and the cup otherwise i call them corn and mixed vegetable goes really well give it a try and tell me what do you think at home guys so basically i'm going to just put a little bit of um coarse sea salt inside of the water and we're gonna make that boil for roughly about 20 minutes all right enjoy it lovely nice one so this is some cauliflower broccoli and carrot right here all right now we have the corn almost ready as you can see that's the corn right there cooking at the moment so we need to add our vegetables just like this I love my vegetables and that's why I'm cooking everything together look at that beautiful and it's gonna be very easy and simple to cook so if you're at home and you want to do something really natural authentic this is coming really handy from chef record and the team so I did a lot of video on this I always doing video on our broccoli cauliflower vegetables and how to be healthy, eating healthy, looking good. That's Chef Ricardo. And I may always do this kind of video, guys, because these are my kind of thing where I like, I like to share with my fans them how to stay healthy and looking healthy. All right? Give that another good five to six minutes and it will be ready. So enjoy it. Nice and lovely. So once your water boil up like that, that's it. Your vegetable is ready. So now we're going to just simply pour it off and you know what i mean it's just amazing simple and you can share it with anything you like to share it with and you can eat it on its own just like that enjoy it and i will see you next time with more recipe from chef ricardo how to make your vegetable cook your vegetable at home in a simple and easier way anywhere anyhow anytime as you can see for yourself chef ricardo vegetable cooking today and i will see you next time bye bye nice and beautiful so basically i have some lamb chops which i lamb chops which i marinated um i marinate them and i take them back from the freezer and defrost them so i want to add a little bit more season to it to bring in a lovely some mint lamb look at this all i'm going to do is get some more mint sauce, roughly about a one and a half tablespoon of mint sauce and salt little bit of lamb season Right. So what we're going to do is just rub it in. Right. Let's rub it up like this. And this is a lamb which I marinated already. You know, Chef Ricardo loves to make the thing look nice. All right, guys. Then what I'm gonna do? Get a tray and place it in the tray like this. Beautiful. <coughs> Once you place it in the tray, uh, that what you need to do is 
have some tomato I'm going to be roast this tomato inside with the lamb and they're really really juicy tomato so we got some red one in also I'm gonna put it aside enjoy it subscribe leave your comments in the description box and I'm gonna roast this off in the oven enjoy the recipe guys nice and lovely so that's the lamb just finished you cannot overcook lamb look at that beautiful lamb tomato which you roast off you know what I mean in this nice lovely lamb sauce in the bottom of it but it's just beautiful never dried out and just moisture and nice. So basically the lamb take about 20 minutes, 25 minutes in the oven on a medium size heat. And that's exactly what I'm talking about. You guys can do the same thing at home. This can be served with rice potato, roast potato, new potato, whatever you name, you can have it with it. Take the time to say thank you guys for watching my show. You got a lot more recipes, a lot more ideas will be coming. I'm Chef Ricardo on the team. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.